I'm Lisa Kaimanas um, and my job is a, as a project officer for Remake and Beamish uh, and we're here at Norman Cornish's house and we're doing a wonderful activity today which is Make Your Mark. So uh, the building that we're standing in front of is 33 Bishop's Close Street and uh, well it's a recreation of and this is where Norman lived with his wife Sarah and their two children John and Anne um, and it's basically it was a national coal board house uh, so it basically came as part of his job as a miner and he was a hewer in the Dean and Chapter Pit. Make Your Mark was actually an opportunity, uh, so we heard the story from Sarah originally, how um, when she wallpapered, so before she wallpapered she would obviously strip the walls and Norman would go into the house and he saw this giant canvas for him to paint whatever he liked on the wall. Uh, so Make Your Mark came about because we thought this was a brilliant opportunity for people to come along and uh, make their mark in the actual house of Norman, just like Norman did. Uh, so we've invited people from the Spennymoor community, uh, we've also invited the family members and we've invited um, Basically we did a competition called Make Your Mark where people could apply and then we chose their names randomly from a hat, a Beamish hat, uh, and uh, they can come in here and make their mark today. Well I've drawn uh, like my friends with me, Luca, John and me, and we're playing football for Spennymoor and Newcastle and I've scored a hat trick and it's very silly. I'm drawing Notre Dame. So what's in front of this so far? So what I'm drawing at the moment, I'm drawing one of the little indented arches where the statues are. Um, but at the moment I've only got the base down, so it's probably going to take a while until I finish it. My uh, Make Your Mark, uh, it was a, a colliery banner and I decided to use the theme of unity is strength in the middle of the banner because um, that was actually the, the, the symbol in the centre of the Durham uh, Miners Gala uh, mural. Um, the central theme on the central banner stated unity is strength, which I believe was a, a mantra of the, the mine workers at the time. I also have a, a symbol of um, two people shaking hands which also appeared uh, on my father's mural but also on the Dean and Chapter colliery banner on the reverse. Um, so it's giving a nod to the, to the past. Well the first thing I did was I recreated a moment in time back in Norman's past when he returned from a hospital um, stay to find that his wife Sarah had decided to wallpaper the house only he'd arrived back earlier than expected the walls were bare so whilst they were bare he couldn't resist the opportunity to paint on them and he painted a cartoon image by Chad called what no wallpaper it's a face peeping over and I just had to recreate that because that was like just a little nod back to the past but my main piece was uh, a focus on a huge miner's lamp. In fact, Norman's own miner's lamp, which I brought here today, with his number 2081 um, on the front. It was a lamp he got from the lamp cabin as a 14-year-old boy, starting his first day at the pit. And he kept that lamp for 33 years. Uh, obviously, he treasured it. It was precious to him and we have it today and I felt that that was quite a symbolic piece to put on the wall of this house and um, with the flame lit in it it kind of gave me um, a thought about how his light still shines brightly today his legacy still lives on so I put a message that said light and legacy your light shines brightly so the piece that I've done inside is my representation of the umbrellas in Durham because I got my first commission as an artist this year in Lumiere's Brilliant Scheme which um, was inspired by the umbrellas in Durham um, and as I'm from Spennymoor and Norman Cornish was from Spennymoor I thought it was a good tie um, to do um, a piece that was inspired by my first commission in the Norman Cornish house as we're both artists. I've kind of like been chosen 
and I'm very honoured to be invited to Beamish to do um, and to put my kind of like mark on the wall and to really pay homage to Norman Cornish and his work which is something that I really wanted to get across um, in my artwork and in kind of my mark because I incorporated a lot of his styles, I incorporated the silhouette of the two miners in the lamppost um, and I think it's really important nowadays in a age which is kind of evolving so much technological wise um, it's really important to just go back and take it back to the more basic well not really basic but the more kind of like calming areas of life which is something that Norman focused a lot on I do believe he just focused on painting what he saw rather than what people want to see. So a lot of people are really excited about this because actually this is a legacy that they will have that their mark will always be in this building and what we're going to do as well is we're going to have some kind of projection of their images um, after we have wallpapered so people can see the hard work that they did in uh, making their mark in Norman's.